It feels good. It feels good. I mean, you know, any type of win at this point is, is a good win for us. And, um, you know, I, I give all the credit to the players. They really played the scout well, I thought, for the most part. And um, they executed the game plan. It just came down to the end where they just hit three after three after three, and we weren't close enough, knowing that they needed threes. And I think that was really the difference. Yeah, I just, you know, at the halftime, I was just say, saying to them, you know, you just need to relax. You know, you could tell Lauren was really excited when she was out there. And sometimes when you're really excited, your shot's off and you can't make, uh, make anything from the perimeter. So um, they did kind of manhandle us a little bit in the first half. But I think Sarah really fought hard. Uh, Kylie fought hard on the boards. And I think that kind of helped a little bit. And then just realizing that everybody needs to box out. And if we can do that, we'll have a chance to rebound. So... We just decided that we were going to uh, run a different zone offense a little bit to start. And really, you know, I don't, I'm not sure that really made a big difference in the game. It was more of just settling in and hitting shots. I mean, when it comes down to it, that's what happened. In the first half, we couldn't hit a thing from the perimeter. So we tried to get a little bit closer to the basket. So trying to get more like post ups and layups and things like that. So, you know, it, it's, it's tough when. Um, you know, every practice you're out there and you're trying to shoot and I'm asking them to shoot. We're doing a lot of shooting drills and then you come out in a game and it's the first game of the year. So maybe there's a little bit of um, first game jitters and that's why they didn't um, hit shots. But I expect that we'll shoot better as the year goes on. Very pleased with the shot selection. To me, I mean, they weren't bad shots. Uh, and, and really, it was probably my fault at the end. I was telling them to slow it down and, you know, run the offense and use the clock. And then we, we, we looked a little haphazard at the end, I thought. Um, and then they come down and they hit three, so it looks bad for us. But, uh, yeah, the shot selection I didn't think was poor. And we had what we wanted. We just didn't hit them. I, I like the balance in the scoring, and, and uh, Tiasia McGeorge had nine and really didn't play a ton of minutes in the second half. Um, so that's almost five people in double digits, which I would love to see day in and day out. To me, they had 14 offensive rebounds, so they had second chance points. But for me, it was more the fouling, you know, the, the reaching fouls that puts them on the line, or, they're, or they foul not hard enough to make sure that they don't make the shot, but, you know, now they get the and one. So I'd like to take some of those away um, and really focus on moving our feet and not using our hands to play defense. You know, I thought because they were guarding us tighter in the second half, at least when they were playing man, that we should have put our head down a little bit and gone to the rim and just made better decisions. Everything that we looked at when we penetrated was inside, and what was available was outside. So I just think we need to make better decisions. But, yeah, I mean, I want a combination of perimeter shots, drives to the baskets, and some, throw some post-ups in there. Um, it was really good to get uh, a win as our first game under our belt. Um, I think that... I know for myself personally, I was a little bit nervous just because it was the first game. So I think that we did a really good job of just keeping up the intensity. They made a few runs, but we kind of held them, didn't let them go any further. Um, I think we have some, we had some learning experiences, but overall it was a good game and it's nice to get that first win. I think it's just really great to get a win like Lauren said. I mean, I don't not the fact that I put it all on my shoulders. My teammates get me the ball when I'm open and I get them the ball when they're open. So I mean, it's just a matter of who's open and who has the hot hand. So I think we did a good job sharing the ball. We got a lot of open perimeter shots, especially in the second half that we were able to capitalize on. Jen, Jen is very capable of doing a lot of things for us. A lot of things that also don't show up on the stat sheet too. She's a great player. And I think that really showed tonight in her ability to rebound, pass and score at the same time. Um, it's definitely been a transition. Um, the game is a lot faster than high school and AAU basketball as well. Um, it's a lot more physical, so it's been an adjustment getting used to that. But I mean, in terms of just playing, I've felt more comfortable and my teammates have been great and the coaches have been great, you know, saying let the game come to you, don't rush your shots. And so it turned out well. We, I think we could have done a better job of keeping our hand up. Um, people are going to hit shots, and we know that, so we got to just make sure that we make it difficult for them. We have to be able to guard penetration and close out, so I think that that's something that we could definitely improve on. I think it's a product of our offense. I mean, we take what the defense gives us, and we're able to hit um, three-point shots. Yeah, I mean, I just took the shots that like I knew I was open for. I wasn't really thinking, like, oh, I'm going to take threes, but... We were just, I think our shot selection was decent. Um, we weren't forcing things, but I mean, a lot of people, obviously the scoring was very even, so that was good that everyone stepped up on the team. 
Uh, what an interesting team we saw for the Eagles. We'll, uh, Mike, what do we have next? Play for a senior to start her season off the right way. Last time she was on this floor, missed the game-tying three-pointer in the Patriot League tournament against Buckner.